I did. I saw the Northern Lights in Tromsø in Norway. Um, let me just move my head out of the way so you can see the picture. This is one of the pictures that I took. Um, weirdly, it doesn't look like this um, when you actually see the Northern Lights in person. So this is another one that I took. Um, you definitely, you can sometimes see like a little bit of green, um, but you definitely, well, I didn't see any of the pink anyway. This is another one of my favourites as well. So what it kind of looks like when you look at the Northern Lights, it's like um, kind of like a white glow, but you have to sort of be outside um, in the dark and really let your eyes adjust to what you're seeing um, because like if you're looking at your phone or something all the time then your eyes don't have that opportunity to adjust so when you do go and see the northern lights definitely <clears throat> take some time just to just to sit with them and have a look and maybe not take any photos and just to see what you can see with your own eyes it, it really is fascinating I mean sometimes it kind of it reminded me a little bit of like a like an alien spaceship coming into shot sort of thing um like with all the lights um but when you take the photo it's definitely very different to what you see in person there's also apps out there where people can pin where the aurora is being sighted which are amazing um what we did was we hired a car out in norway and every time there was a pin on this um on this app of the location where the aurora was we were straight there this is the app that I use. Um, you've got the live Aurora webcams as well. Um, and when people see the Aurora, they literally pin the location um, and it tells you on the map up here. It's really, really good. Happy Aurora hunting.